Hi, it's John. It's the 14th of December 2016 and I'm in Piddle Hinton and this is a really nice little footpath and bridge here. Stone pavers laid nicely coming up to a little wall and a little bridge take water off of the road down into the valley and then a kissing gate to the Millennium Meadow, which I haven't seen yet. So here's an old field with some ridges in it, and that must be the Millennium Meadow over there, with a little adventure playground. Yippee! I've gradually been wa working my way along the Piddle Valley from Henley Buckland Newton up all these footpaths up by the side looking for you know nice scenes and I've really been enjoying it. The man there feeding his sheep. There's a nice little view. The lichen on the gate and the apples left on the tree. There's an orchard here, old orchard, and a um, a haw haw with this old house up there. I'll show you in a minute. But uh, apples left on trees are quite good for the thrushes and things like that. They thought, oh, okay, it's a waste of human resources, but the thrushes and that peck at them when they fall on the ground. There we have it, the idyllic setting. Beautiful horse chestnut tree. That is a, well, perfect shape. And it's got a little iron fence around it at the bottom to stop horse, horses gnawing off the bark. And then in the forefront, just over the gate, is a, a small orchard with a few apple trees. And I would say just that fence where that fence is, is a bit of a, somewhere there it's a bit of a haw haw to, to um, in the olden days to make the garden look bigger I suppose that co uh, house there would go back to about 1700 uh, 17 uh, that, uh, 1800 something like that I guess beautiful house and of course you know one may think it's a bit unjust for a person to live in such a place, but it's there and it's there for the next generation as well. So it's good, all is good. And we're starting to get the evening light now, which makes things a bit more exciting. Looks like they might've had some big horse chestnut tree felled in fairly recently huge chunks up there gnarly chunks horse chestnut i mean it's not too it's a, it's a fairly soft wood for cutting up probably not that good for burning um but be quite a lot of you'd have to chop those lumps up with a chainsaw i think i don't think they would split a bit too gnarly there's a welcome site see the footpath sign on the gate post on the left so i could go straight across that field and the footpath also goes to the left, so on another day I could try going up there 
see where that goes. There's a ford here with a footbridge. There's a man on the internet who loves taking videos of fords. I'm on my way back now. I haven't been shot at. That's an old barn. Came in, converted into a house. It was on the market for a long time. Some disadvantages with, well, being born in a barn. Were you born in a barn? Shut that door. Back to the car.